All the World's a Stage is a double live album by Canadian rock band Rush, released in 1976. The album was recorded at Massey Hall in Toronto on June 11, 12, and 13 during their 2112 tour. The title of the album alludes to William Shakespeare's play As You Like It, which would again be referenced by Rush in their 1981 song, Limelight. The band's lead singer and bassist, Getty Lee, said in 2017 that the album was definitely something we used to buy us more time. Topic. Content This performance of 2112 omits the discovery and oracle, the dream sections of the studio recording. Although the final 32 seconds of discovery are played as a lead into presentation, the liner notes and track listing do not indicate this. Rush would not perform the entire suite live until the 1996-97 test for Echo Tour, as documented on the live album Different Stages. The album closes with a bit of post-show chatter among the band members and the sound of a slamming of a door as they leave the venue. According to the liner notes, this live album Rush's first marks the end of the first chapter of Rush and would begin a trend of Rush releasing a live album after every four studio albums. This lasted until 2003, when the band released a live album and DVD of each subsequent studio album's tour. The medley of Working Man, Finding My Way, is a split tune which runs as follows. Working Man first half, Finding My Way, Working Man second half, Neil Peart Incorporated drum solo. Before the band jams out the end of the medley. Toronto rock band Max Webster was the opening act for all three performances of the recording of the album. Topic. Reception All the World's a Stage was Russia's first U.S. Top 40 charting album and went gold, alongside A Farewell to Kings and 2112 on November 16, 1977. It was certified platinum in the U.S. in 1981 after the release of Moving Pictures. In Canada, gold certification came on December 1, 1976, and platinum on August 1, 1978. Topic. 1997 remaster A remaster was issued in 1997. The tray has a picture of the star with man painting mirroring the cover art of Retrospective I with the Rush remasters printed in all capital letters just to the left. All remasters from Rush through permanent waves are like this. The original CD omitted What You're Doing and the post-show chatter due to recording length constraints CDs could hold only 75 minutes at the time. By 1997, however, advances in recording technology had increased that maximum time to 80 minutes. The missing song and chatter are included in the remaster. Prior to its release, the same live version of What You're Doing was included on the compilation Chronicles in 1990. The album's original triple gatefold artwork with concert pictures is included with the remaster. All the World's a Stage was remastered again in 2011 by Andy Vandette for the Sector box sets, which re released all of Rush's Mercury era albums. All the World's a Stage is included in the Sector 1 set. All the World's a Stage was remastered for vinyl in 2015 by Sean McGee at Abbey Road Studios as a part of the official 12 Months of Rush. Promotion. The high definition master prepared for this release was also made available for purchase in 24 bit, 96 kHz, and 24 bit, 192 kHz formats, at several high resolution audio online music stores. These masters have significantly less dynamic range compression than the 1997 remasters and the Sector remasters by Andy Vandette. Topic. 
track listing All lyrics written by Neil Peart, all music composed by Getty Lee and Alex Lifeson, except where noted. Personnel Getty Lee, lead vocals, bass Alex Lifeson, guitar, vocals Neil Peart, drums, percussion Terry Brown, engineer Hugh Syme, design George Graves, mastering on original album Bob Ludwig, remastering Topic. Charts Album <laughs>